Hi everyone, so before I end my next project, I wanted to show how I do the visors for these helmets. So I'll be redoing the one I did for my commando helmet that I finished on the last video. So the visor is actually a clear divider you'd find in a binder with a one-way reflective mirror that I bought on Amazon. All together with the material, it only cost me no more than $20 and there was plenty more material for other visors or anything else I want to make a one-way mirror. So to apply this, all you would need is a razor, scissors, um, a plastic card with a cloth or any kind of squeegee, and a spray bottle full of soapy water. So starting off, you want to use a divider as a template to cut out what you'll need for the two-way mirror. With this, I was able to score the film with the razor and then after doing this, I went ahead with the scissors and just cut it straight through. I'm sure with a Zacto knife or a sharper razor, you should be able to cut straight through. Mine just seemed a little dull. So, so after you get your piece cut out, I would get two pieces of tape. Um, in this case, I had the scotch glue. Put them on each side of the film and pull apart. And that will reveal the adhesive layer on the two-way mirror. After that, just spray the water soap solution throughout the divider and apply the mirror to it. Uh, this will make it so it doesn't stick right away and you're still able to move around the film um, and squeeze any of the water through with squeegee. Once I had that done, I just cut off the excess, which was just a little bit left from the last visor I cut out. So I'm using a plastic card here, but it works the same roughly as a squeegee. Um, just push the water through each edge and get rid of any of the air bubbles that become trapped after applying the film. And by doing this, it will get you the best look on your visor when this is all complete. After doing that, I'm using a template from my last helmet to cut off what's needed from a divider. Um, and how to make a template is pretty easy. I would use that leaf paper that comes in a printer and with that you could cut to size and see what's the best fit for your visor before going ahead and cutting it down to what's needed so yeah that's how I did my visor for the commando helmet and it probably will keep doing until I learn how to do vacuum forming a bit more with tinting as well as the mirrored finish um, it looks good here a lot better than how it was before less Increase marks, less air bubbles, and yeah, cost less than $20, so it's a good save if you're on a budget, or if you're looking for something quick and easy just to throw on the helmet itself. So that's all I got for how I do my visors, but if anyone has any questions or things they'd like to see, feel free to leave them in the comments. But yeah, thank you for tagging along in this video.